for so long? It's only been five minutes. <laughs> Since everyone's here, let's get down to business. The Astral Express just received an invitation to the Planet of Festivities. Uh, hang on. Why am I getting a sense of deja vu? Even the Planet of Festivities can't possibly hold a festival every day. Don't worry. The Express received a normal invitation this time. It's from Fenicone's Paperfold University. The University plans to hold an academic conference on the topic of trailblazing in the moment of soul. The Astral Express has been invited as guest to the conference. An academic conference? You mean we'll have to sit in an auditorium and spend several system hours talking about a few hundred slides worth of scholarly discourse? Don't worry, you can leave such boring events to the grown-ups. I will attend the conference with Welt, as for the three of you. If you're interested, you can enter the university as guest students. Well, it happens to be the start of the academic term, and Paperfold University is preparing for its Dreamlight anniversary. These annual festivities serve as both a welcoming gift for new students and a chance to celebrate for those already enrolled. Why don't you youngsters join the new students? Hmm? You could uh, explore the campus, experience student life. Uh, do, do we have to study? Uh, that's great! A young, cute girl full of energy living her best life on campus? That experience is practically made for me. <laughs> I hear that Paperfold University is well known throughout the universe as a top art school. <clears throat> I would love to check it out too. <sighs> campus life. <laughs> Looks like everyone can't wait. Let's go ahead with that plan, then. I will submit the admission documents to Paperfold University. We'll leave once everyone is ready. Let's all have some fun. Campus. <laughs> oh, that word sure brings back a lot of memories. Now that you mention it, I recall that you had a teaching stint back home. Any delightful stories that come to mind? <laughs> yeah, too many to count. Uh, but then again, these admission documents will take us a while to complete. I'll see if I can dig up any stories for you. <sighs> Electives? Oh, extracurricular activities? Campus parties? Oh, I want to try them all! Aw, is someone having a case of nerves? We're just going to school. How bad can it be? Uh, never mind. Let's just relax and enjoy ourselves on campus. I'll be in your care now. As the top university in Penacone, the strict examinations and expensive tuition have deterred many potential candidates. The people who are admitted to the school are either well-known wealthy merchants or exceptionally talented geniuses. Because of this, I hear that the culture on campus has a truly Penaconian flavor. <laughs> How intriguing. that ruckus oh, no, no, no. we've arrived why do you always fall asleep when we're warping i couldn't even wake you up
<sighs> never mind. Just don't look so lost when we're in class later. Or you might just sleep yourself to dream, Flux Reef. All right. Let's go check in. Himiko and Mr. Yang still have to participate in social networking. Being an adult sure is hard. Welcome to the reverie, distinguished shareholders. Oh! I almost forgot that we're Penicone shareholders. Upon hearing the news that you were returning to Penicone, the hotel prepared six platinum guest rooms for your stay. They are ready for you anytime. Um, six? That's right. Besides the three of you, Miss Himiko and Mr. Yang, Pom Pom had already checked in three days ago. Pom Pom? What are you talking about? I see. We thank the family for their gracious hospitality. Please help us with the check-in. Of course. Your dreamscape passes have been activated. I hope that you have another enjoyable stay in Panacone. We didn't have an enjoyable stay the last time, though. Um, apologies for interrupting you earlier. Uh, Don Hung, do you know something that we don't? Why did the front desk mention that Pom Pom is staying at the hotel, too? If my guess is correct, it's probably Boot Hill checking in under Pom Pom's name. Yes. When we worked together in Penacone the last time, he used Pom Pom's identity then, too. <sighs> He's the only one I can think of who would do that. Boot Hill? What is he doing here? I don't know. Galaxy Rangers always work alone. But I don't think Boot Hill will do anything that is uh, detrimental to the Express. Since uh, Pom Pom checked in three days ago, we can probably find him in the dream. We'll ask him more about it then. Uh, let's get going then. A Paperfold University is located in the Moment of Soul. The hotel has set the entrance to the dream near the school. So let's meet at the gate. Hurry up! I hear that the major shareholders have already arrived at the lobby. Don't alarm them! I know! But that fellow was running in this direction! Oh, how did he disappear so quickly? Shh! Someone else is here! Who are you? The what auditions? Sorry, I usually just relax in my free time and never watch variety shows. I don't care who you are. The Bloodhound family is investigating a case here. Please make way. Oh, wait a second. Gray hair, yellow eyes, ribbons that serve no purpose on her clothes. I think she's the major shareholder you were talking about. What? For the love of... Couldn't you have said that earlier? <clears throat> I beg your pardon, esteemed guest. I was a bit brusque earlier. The Bloodhounds are just carrying out a routine inspection. All guest rooms and facilities are in good order. So please be at ease and enjoy your stay. But... the suspect... You... Is it sustainable? Ah, uh, yes, sustainable. We know frequent inspections may not seem sustainable to some, but these procedures ensure a safe and secure environment for guests, so the Bloodhounds are more than happy to do so. We'll take our leave for now. Please have a good rest. Um, please stay safe and be careful in the dream. All right, that's enough. Come on, let's go. Hmm, I'm confused. Maybe I should look around before I enter the dream?
I can't open the box. Something just doesn't feel right. But I can't keep March 7th and Don Hung waiting. Never mind. I'll head to sleep for now. Sure is sealed off. <laughs> no other way. I have to borrow your bed. <sighs> Please forgive me. Focus on your breathing and imagine you're in paradise. Imagine an island. An island. 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 Something strange? Is this Paperfold University? It doesn't look much like a school, but it does look somewhat familiar. Also, what's that? Terrifying close call that was, but fear not. The darkest hour of the night may be upon us, but this majestic skyscraper shall now welcome the start of an epic hunt! Huh? Yo, yo! Under starry skies, evil low and high. Helpless folk in the dark, fighting for their lives. Silent ninja arc, written down in red tears. Noble ninja hearts in the night join here. Stormy tides crashing forth, all evil slain. Come the dawn, shining sparks lighting up again. Yo, yo, dazzling ninja. AKA Rappa, nice to meet ya. Uh, uh. Ah, ouch! <sighs> what kind of devious trap is this? Not only are there feedlings abound, but there are also concealed weapons flying about! Wrapping? <laughs> That's not it. What I'm reciting is the mantra of a ninja! Be gone, feedlings, or I shall give you a taste of my dazzling ninjutsu! That's impossible. How can it be? I... 
I am unable to communicate with these fiendlings. deliver a powerful impact to the soul. I've endeavored to control my strength, but some pain is inevitable if I am to ensure you regain consciousness. Your evil schemes have been exposed. They're calling for their fellow ape feelings. Please, take cover behind me. <sighs> time to Dreams do come true. May the foul stench time to cleanse the filth. Joining the beer. Eternal. No good. We better get moving. I never leave a question unanswered. I am a ninja, aka Rappa. As stated in the cosmic ninjutsu inscriptions, be decisive, lest we be overwhelmed by the consequences. There are still feedlings roaming nearby. Let us be on our way. Seeing monkeys and the seeing ninja. Am I dreaming? You can return to a safe location after touching this object. Pinacani truly is filled with boundless mysteries. Since fate saw fit to bring us together, may I know your name before we part ways? Ooh, a strong name. Well met, baseball bat ninja. Forgive me for speaking out of turn, Baseball Bat Ninja, but for your safety, you and your companion should leave this land of dreams as soon as possible. 
The appearance of these feelings are a sign of impending disaster. It is proof that the ninja hero's arch enemy has their eyes set on the land. The emotionless, soulless, and merciless evil ninja Osaru! It's time for me to depart. Please do take care. Goodbye. This does look like the way out. Let's go. A long, long time ago, in a world far away, there was a city that flourished under the rule of a ninja hero for many generations. It was known as the Ninja Capital. Under the protection of the ninja hero, the people of the city thrived. They lived and worked in peace, and happiness could be felt even in the sewers of the Ninja Capital. Until... An evildoer known as Eva Ninja Osaru murdered the ninja hero and laid claim to the city. The happiness of days past disappeared in an instant. Oh, child, new to the way of the ninja, I recognize your determination. Henceforth, you shall be the successor to my dazzling ninjutsu. Thank you, Master Kucha. This is my greatest honor. Behold the city of shadow, that sinful land of suffering, hatred, and sorrow. Bloody tears soon to devour all hope for the morrow. Soulless evil ninja, or Saru, Agent of the vile, cast the masses into sin by foul arts and guile. Fiendlings indulgent in evil gone wild enrage the hearts of all man, woman, and child. Inherit the legacy of the ninja hero and wipe clean the sins of Osaru. End the suffering wrought upon the ninja capital and bring peace back to its people. An astounding recitation of the ninja mantra, Master Kucha. I swear I will train hard until I become the dazzling ninja. An admirable resolution. Uh, to contend with the evil ninja, you will also need a new name. A name befitting a ninja. What should I be called? I don't know, my disciple. Your name will carry your ideals, your convictions, and your destiny. Your ninja name belongs to you alone. So the decision is yours to make. What a baffling dream. I should now be at Paperfold University, right? <laughs> <laughs>